He's running. Oh, he just. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, now that was sick. Now that was sick. That right there was sick. That right there was sick, dude. That's sick. What's up, Jay? Doing all right, you? Yeah. Man, I and got us some cigar minnows. We're gonna do some sight casting for some redfish on the beach. We got my cousin, Captain Lionel James, right here out of Destin, Florida. And uh, he makes this stuff look so easy. So, we got bait, we got rods, we're all rigged up. The next thing to do is to just find a fish and cast at him and see if we can get hooked up. Let's go. All right, so we just missed one. Uh, Missed one and ended up getting a blue fish, which is fine. But we're right here on them. Lionel's got about 10 fish spotted. We're gonna hook us another live cigar minnow and see if we can make a good cast. I think the most difficult part of this is making a good cast. So we're gonna hook that cigar minnow right between the eyes and uh, see if we can't present this guy. Perfect. Cast it at one o'clock right underneath the beach. Go for it. Right there. Right there. Okay. All right, I got my 706 and a eight foot or nine foot ninja dagger rod. This is like a surf rod, but I use it for casting long distances when I'm on boats and piers, and uh, it's just an awesome, awesome rod. I like the backbone. Oh, I see him. Can you see him? Yeah. This water is so clear, you can literally see everything. Lots of stingrays, lots of ladyfish, quite a few bonita. As the sun comes up, I'm starting to see more and more fish. He can see a lot better because he has the height advantage, but he's able to put us on the fish. And then he's pointing to me in different directions, whether it be 12 o'clock, one o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock. And that's where I need to cast at. So a lot of work goes into it and it's a team effort a couple of shots so far and we've uh we haven't hooked up just yet but we will here soon i know it oh yeah i see him you can make it send it go far enough okay all right. all right let me spot him again okay i see him All right, hopefully I got the fight, but we did get us one finally. And uh, man, it was, a, it was a good fight. And that guy's ready to go, he's gone. <laughs> That's one, let's see if we can get on another one. Let's go. And uh, hopefully get that whole entire fight. I don't know why my GoPro turned off. Could be because it's getting kind of warm out here and GoPros have a mind of their own sometimes. So if you guys haven't already, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Hopefully we got some of that fight on before the GoPro shut off. And uh, we're gonna go and see if we can catch up to that school again and make it happen. Let's go. 
<laughs> okay, I see him. I see him. Good gracious, that's a lot of fish. On this fish all day. Should I should I go ahead and get ready to cast? Go for it. If you can reach it, just make sure that bag is gonna pull that bait down from the fish. It's still really deep over there. Okay. Go for it. Let me make sure I see him. Okay, I see him. Yep. He's running. Oh, he just he's got it, he's got it, he's got it, he's got it. Yes! Yes! Now that was sick. Now that was sick. That right there was sick. That right there was sick, dude. That sick came running out of the water and he came up and got it, dude. That was awesome. Right there on the beach. Oh, he pulled. What happened? Okay, he must have been skin hooked because I still got my hook. That was sick. Back up while you get okay. Ready. Yes, sir. All right. Bro. That was awesome. Nice stuff, baby. That was awesome. That was the kind of eats we're looking for, guys. Woo. Let's go with a little bit bigger one. Let's get back in position. I got one. Yep. All right. Fish on. That's the most important part. Yep. He's going to run that way. <laughs> yes. Sight casting reds on the beach with Captain Lionel James. We are bowed up and bowed up good. Woo! He's heavy. We got him on our 706 with this Ninja Dagger rod. Look at him thrashing out there. Move back to the front. See if we can get some line in on him. See him down there in the water. It's going to turn back. Take your little line. He's still got some fight in him. Okay. Get a little fired up. <laughs> Woo! It's gonna ride away then. Snug down a little bit on that drag. See if we can bring him in. Yeah. He's fired up. really got this rod bowed over. There we go. I think it's fine. We're starting to get tired. He's turning towards the boat. There he is. He's going to run under the boat. There he is. Trying to run under the boat. All right. Let's swim right on in. Come on, man. Look at that on. net job. Let's A go. beautiful net job. Let's freaking and go. That's fish number two. For me, that's a fat. Yo, I'm trying to tell you, bro. Fat fish. Come on, Good. man. Good. <laughs> Woo. 
I want y'all to look at this guy right here. That is a fat, fat fish. Woo! Let's get him unhooked. We'll show him to you guys. All right, got this fish unhooked. Let's lay her out and see how much she'll go on the measuring, measuring board. Right at zero. And that fish will go about right at 30. Right at 30. Oh, oh gorgeous, gorgeous redfish. Sight cast it right off of the beach, right here in Florida. My man. Come on, baby. Yes. Yes, sir. Too easy. Yes. Get a good revive on her. And I'm just holding her tail. Gonna work her back and forth through the water. Make sure her gills are under the water while we're reviving. And we're just gonna pull her back and forth and just kind of wobble her so she can get back in the motion of swimming. Don't want to release her too early and she'll kick when she's ready. Fish is probably tired because it's so hot, but she's ready. We're gonna push her. And there she goes. Nice fat fish. Come yes, on, sir. Baby, y'all thin. Yes. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Woo. Let's do it again. All right. Man. Nice fish right there. It's starting to get a little hot out here. Seeing those fish come up top chasing after those cigar minnows because they're they're hugging the bottom and they're just surfing, cruising in the surf looking for sand fleas and other things, catching that bait off guard. But when they see that big cigar minnow, they come up top and they just devour it. You can see that that cigar minnow skip across the water once and then it's over from there. There's so many fish, there's no getting away from them. We're gonna see if we can't get back on them and get hooked up again. Let's go. That leader is still good. We got about a four out circle hook and uh, 20, 25 pound monofilament fluorocarbon leader. Anyone will work. So I switched to my 6,500. That might be too far out. Dude, you saw that? Yeah. I saw that line. Look how that's That's a heavy line. Let me let's try one more time and then I'll switch leader. A lot of fish right here along the coast, guys. Amazing. Amazing school of fish. Line is gonna put us right in position to where we can get these guys. We can get a good cast on them. He got it. He at least had it. I felt him. He definitely had it. Must have dropped it. Yeah, he had it. Look at what he did to that bait. Let's get us another fresh bait. Look at Lionel's on already, oh, like clockwork. Let's go, let's go. You got eight. All right, Lionel's on. <laughs> Look at this guy, man. He does this all the time. Let me sit this guy in here. Let Lionel do his thing. Man, you guys won't believe that he comes out and does this by himself uh, for fun. So easy, folks. That's a big fish. That's a bigger fish. Yeah. Come on. Want me to get in that? Yeah, let's do it, baby. I'll be out here. I'll be out. <laughs> Here we go. There he is. Oh, Just come like on, that. Man. Come yes, on, sir. Y'all see it. Woo! Y'all see it. Thank you, sir. No Thank problem. You, sir. Come on, look at it. 
A got? nice long red fish. Maybe. Barely has one spot split up into two. And then that was a little more so. pronounced. We're gonna get this girl loose. The mission is to get my cousin on, but you know, Captain's gotta get some too, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Let's That's go, crazy. folks. That fish is still fired up and ready to go. Yeah. Hey man, let's do it. Let's yeah. go. We still keeping up with him? Yeah, that was awesome. Yes. Yes. Oh man. He chased it way off the school, came and got it, and then he let it go and then turned around, came back. Lionel told me to stop the bait and he came and just swooped it up, dude. That was insane. That was insane. That was insane. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Man, this is so awesome. To watch these fish chase that bait the way they do, it's just so awesome. These fish got so much power. Look at that. Wherever he turns and runs, that's where he's gonna go. Wherever he points his head at. Make it look easy. Make Come it look on, easy. Baby. Let's freaking go. Yes. <laughs> Come on, that's a bigger fish. Another bro. stud that's red. Yours, baby. That's all yours. Another Come stud on. red fish. Insane. Come on, man. It's insane. That's like fish number four or five. Man. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Woo. There we go, guys. Another beautiful, beautiful redfish. That circle hook is somewhere way down in that fish's mouth. He wanted that cigar minnow because he chased it, spit it out, turned around, came back and got it. Changed his mind a couple times, but he came back to get it. Wow. Come on, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Let's, Let's get him unhooked. All right, a lot of you guys come down to the Gulf Coast looking for charter boat captains to go fishing with. And a lot of people go after the same thing, red snapper, vermilion snapper. But if you want to get on something cool, sight fish, you know, it's a lot more challenging for the more experienced anglers. And hey, the non, not so experienced anglers, Lionel will put you right on him. He'll show you exactly what to do. And you guys can catch fish after fish after fish, just like this one. Go home let's with go, stories baby. to tell. Let's go. All right, let's let this fish go. That's a thumbnail right there. <laughs> Lion's tail of the bitch right here. That fish is fired up, ready to go. So we're gonna go ahead and get a quick release on him and he's gone. Just like that. Woo! Yeah! You see him? Yeah, he did. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh, man. Yes! 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 Woo -hoo -hoo. yes. Yeah, it was. Man, it's so funny. You see them all moving together, and then you'll see one just stray away, and you know he's going after that bait. <laughs> That's so funny, man. Amazing. Look 
Look at that school of ladyfish just going absolutely nuts on bait. It's a good fish. It's gonna go under the boat. I'm gonna put some on him, try and get his head up. And he doesn't like that. That fish is big in. Okay, he's got my arms on fire now. Woo, that fish is mad. He got close to the boat and he didn't like that. I tried to bring his head up too early and the, he turned the fight on then. Giving that Shimano Terramar rod a run for its money. Let's see if we can get him. There it is. Oh my goodness, dude. Oh my goodness. Fish after fish. Oh man, you can do the honors. Still fish. Nice work. Yes, sir. Come on. Yes, sir. Man. All right, set this rod down. We'll get him out of the net. Then we'll unhook him. Those circle hooks are doing their job. As you can see, the placement on that. Beautiful. And that fish is croaking. It's the first one to croak today. They can all drum for sure. Sometimes they use that drum to uh, locate crabs and things, sand fleas, you name it. Another beautiful specimen. Another beautiful specimen. And that fish is bleeding just a little bit. Ooh, big tail slap. They're tough. <laughs> They're tough. You pierced the lips, bro. Yeah. <laughs> right. Woo. Oh man. Man. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go, guys. Probably not shallow enough. Yeah. Much better cast. Let's see what happens. He's on. It is so hard, but it makes it look easy. We lost these fish. Lionel found them again. Look at that. Something behind him, maybe another red fish. Got him fired up. These fish look so pretty on the beach. Not your usual red fish. These are Gulf of Mexico reds cruising up and down the beach. This will pull you off your balance if you're not careful. Look at that. Look at that. Woo! And that drag is not loose, trust me. That fish just got fired up and wanted to go the other way. And it's gonna take another run. That is insane. Fish has got to be tired. It's giving us some good runs. There it is. That's number six or seven on the trip, on the day. Woo! I appreciate it. There it is. 
And another croaker. That fish is drumming. Get you some breaths, some deep breaths. Oh. Mm. That was a nice release right there. Splash the camera. I love it. I love it. This is insane, man. This is insane. You know, for a second I was skeptical about whether or not we were going to find fish. And then we found the fish and for some reason I couldn't get a good uh, presentation on the fish. So I was doubting myself a little bit. Stayed persistent. Lionel kept putting me on them, telling me what to do. I was freelining those baits a little bit too much and uh, Lionel told me that I need to be pulling those bait down, pull them down into the fish because those fish are just cruising the bottom and that water's a little bit deeper than you think it is right there off of the shore. So started pulling those baits down into the fish and sure enough started getting hooked up. We're gonna get baited up. We're gonna try and get doubled up. Doubled up, we're in the zone Lionel says, let's go. Brought something for you. What? I totally forgot, man. I'm sorry. It ain't nothing big. It's probably all wet now, but the box is all wet. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. I appreciate that. I brought this one for you to get to your clients. The box is all wet, so you have to, uh, not your clients, but your subscribers, man. So thanks for the love. Man. You sure? Yeah, man. That's what I brought it for, man. So that's nuts. You'll have to send it some kind of way, but man, I just. You know, I appreciate you coming out fishing with me, man. I appreciate it, brother. Yeah, man. Man, guys, Lionel just gifted me two reels right here. And uh, somebody's going to be a lucky winner to one of these reels right here because uh, he said he bought one for my subscribers. Florida, Florida Fishing Products reels, some awesome stuff. He uses it every man. time he goes out and lets his clients use them. So I, I really it, appreciate man. it, brother. Man, too easy, bro. Thanks, bro. Thanks for coming out with me, man. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Guys, so that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. If you haven't already, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And, uh, you know, I try to stay consistent as I can, but, you know, it's really hot out. The fishing hasn't been as great on my end, but Lionel's been killing it, putting his clients on fish almost every single day during the summer. And like he said, it is hot. So, uh, again, guys, I appreciate each and every one of you. I'm going to try and keep the content rolling in as much as I can as well as staying busy in my everyday life. But uh, I appreciate you guys. So we will see you in the next one. I'm Vitamin D from Vitamin D TV, and I'm out. Peace.